Finding a practical form of meditation is very important. I like spending time with my son, walking the dogs, uh, preparing food, sitting down, relaxing and eating and chewing every mouthful when I eat. Having an Epsom salt bath once a week with magnesium, doing nice, slow, deep breathing while I'm in the bath. So really pumping and massaging all my organs and really clearing my mind. I like doing that every day when I do all my mobility work for my neck, all my corrective postural work. Uh, I don't find just sitting still and doing nothing very therapeutic for me. Uh, I have to be doing something that's aiding me uh, in a way that um, is going to balance my body. But the simplest for me is just lying down and I'll just put a um, support in my neck and just roll up a towel or have a um, peanut ball that I put behind my neck and that mows my neck into the right shape and I just focus on breathing, just clear my mind and just get rid of every thought and just keep coming back to the breath and just feel that healing energy that comes from a peaceful mind and not being overly active. So I like doing that every day. I find it's really effective, plus the other forms of meditation. But each of us needs to find what works for us and what we can do consistently. It's nice and it's a great idea for everyone to sit in lotus posture and have this perfect you know, meditative practice that they do. But we've got to be realistic and we've all got 24 hours and we've got to make it work somehow. Uh, and just because you don't fit into this perfect model doesn't mean you can't benefit from some form of meditative practice. So finding that, getting it done every day, ticking it off 20 minutes is so worth it.